What's up, everybody? Doc Dark 1985. There's levels to this. So the Series S, once again, once again, finds itself in uh, in very interesting conversations. That's what I'm going to say. No stranger on this channel talking about the Series S. Not at all. Spoken about it many times. I, however, will not make the same mistake that I've made before in the past. I'm not going to pretend to be a developer. I'm not going to pretend to be a technical expert. I didn't even look at that video that Digital Foundry put out. I just know that they put something out. All I'm going to do is do what I know how to do. What I'm confident in doing. And that's talking from the gamer's perspective. So as an Xbox gamer, this is what I'm going to tell you. If a game is not optimized for the Xbox Series X and the S, I'm done buying it anywhere else. I just won't. I just won't say whatever you want to say with that. It, it, it doesn't matter because at this point, it's a combination of the gamers and Microsoft holding these developers accountable. Let, let me explain something to you. What would be the incentive of a developer to optimize a game for the Series X when that same gamer will just turn around and buy it for the PS5, the console that is easier to develop for. Now, obviously, I say easier because I don't know if it's easier or not. But I'm just saying that's what they've been saying, right? That it's easier to develop for. Maybe the Xbox Series X and S are the better consoles, are the ones that have the better tools or whatever, but there's no need to invest in learning how to use the tools when you're still going to sell your copy of the game on the PS5. Why would you waste more time and effort when you're still going to get the same $70 or $60 or whatever on the PS5. We know that a lot of gamers out there have multiple consoles. We know that there's more PS5s and PS4 out there than there are Xboxes. So why would, why would a developer waste their time figuring out how to optimize a game for the Xbox platform when they're still going to get their money from that same gamer that probably has a PlayStation? So as a gamer, you have to do your part. That's what I'm taking it as. Too, too, too many games. Too many games. So I got it. If a game is not optimized on the Xbox Series X or the Xbox Series S, I will not cater to the developer and the publisher and buy it on the PS5. I won't. Some of you out there will. Some of you will say, I'm going to play it where it plays best. By all means, do what you do. It's your money. That's what you want to do. I'm letting you know what I'm going to do. And if you're someone out there that even cares about seeing remotely what this console could potentially do, the Xbox Series X, then I suggest you take my advice and you do the same thing. Because again, what's the incentive of a developer to actually put effort into making the, the games work on these boxes when they're already working on the other box and it's easy to develop for? I don't know how weak or how strong the Xbox Series S is. But what I do know for a fact is that games are not optimized for the Xbox platform. So if it's not optimized for the Xbox platform, that's the Xbox Series X. I mean, what, what, what do you leave the Xbox Series S? I wanted to fall into the trap of believing the, the whole narrative that the Xbox Series S is going to be a streaming system and all this other stuff, blah, blah, blah. No, 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 no. Downscale the game. Fig figure it out. Figure it out. And at the end of the day, have that conversation with Microsoft about game parity. Because if you bought a Series S, then you bought it knowing that you're going to get less than the X, right? $200 of features less than the X, right? 
I guess how far does that go, if that's the case? Let me know what you guys think. As for me as a gamer, I'm going to put my money where my mouth is. I ain't buying no third-party games on the PS5 just because it runs better on the PS5. Mm -mm. I'm going to do my part to see if I get to see the power of the Series X. And if I don't, then it is what it is. Dog Dog 985, there's levels to this. We out. Peace.